It is well known that bodybuilders are extremely vascular. However, have you ever noticed that certain bodybuilders have abnormal looking veins? Take for example, Rich Piana and John Cena. As you can see, the veins on their arms are extremely tortuous, unlike normal blood vessels, which are straight. Another difference is that these abnormal veins are constantly dilated, unlike normal blood vessels, which change in size based on temperature and metabolic demand, such as when exercising. This second difference can be demonstrated in this clip taken from Rich Piana's vlog. He's not got a massive bicep pump in the gym. He's making breakfast in the morning, presumably in an air conditioned house, yet his vein is still extremely prominent. So what are these abnormal blood vessels and why do these bodybuilders have them? What's the story with his veins and the and and calves and the front? I, I, I've never seen that before. Yeah, uh, I, I don't really know, but that, I, I think it's something that he can uh, take care of. Yeah. So. But there's definitely something going on there. It's a little bit too thick, those veins. Yeah. I would definitely yeah. have this checked out. The medical term for these blood vessels is varicose veins. Varicose is Latin for varus, meaning bent outwards, referring to their dilated nature. To understand the cause of varicose veins, it's first important to look at the anatomy of a vein. Veins contain valves. These valves prevent blood from flowing backwards within the vein, ensuring blood flows in one direction towards the heart. Varicose veins occur when these valves break, thereby allowing blood to flow backwards within the vein, causing the vein to become enlarged and tortuous. Varicose veins are a common condition, however, they typically occur in the legs of middle-aged women. So what causes these valves to break, and why are varicose veins more common in women? The cause of these valves breaking is high blood pressure, forcing the valve leaflets apart. There are several reasons why the incidence of varicose veins is higher in women compared to men. Women become pregnant. During pregnancy, the weight of the baby puts pressure on the pelvic veins, compressing them, thereby increasing the blood pressure downstream in the legs. Also, women are at higher risk of developing blood clots in their legs due to having higher estrogen levels. Blood clots in the deep veins block blood flow, thereby forcing blood to reroute from the deep veins to the superficial veins, again increasing blood pressure. So why do these male bodybuilders have varicose veins in their arms? The reason is due to the use of anabolic steroids. Firstly, at supraphysiological levels, testosterone stimulates blood vessels to constrict, resulting in increased blood pressure. Secondly, anabolic steroids stimulate heart muscle growth. This therefore decreases the space within the heart chamber to pump blood, consequently decreasing the volume of blood the heart can pump per beat. As a result, blood backs up upstream of the heart, again increasing blood pressure. Thirdly, testosterone is converted to estrogen by an enzyme called aromatase. Increased estrogen, as explained previously, is associated with an increased risk of varicose veins. As a side note, this is the reason why bodybuilders who take anabolic steroids also take aromatase inhibitors. Aromatase inhibitors block the conversion of testosterone to estrogen, thereby reducing the risk of estrogen-associated conditions such as blood clots, varicose veins, and gynecomastia.